In San Jose, police have arrested more than 30 people, all of them accused of sexual assault. Police held a news conference today with the latest information, and Cron Forest Charles Clifford was there. He joins us live. Charles? Yeah. Yeah, well, the San Jose Police Department says they have uh, pulled their resources to get more than two dozen sex offenders off the streets, accused sex offenders. The San Jose Police Department says that between the first of the year and Valentine's Day, 35 suspects were taken into custody on outstanding warrants. All are San Jose residents and their alleged crimes range from misdemeanor sexual assault to felony counts of sexual assault of a minor and rape. Some of the alleged crimes occurred as far back as 2016. Investigators say they are looking for additional suspects. I do know that in addition to these 35 that we just arrested, there are still some outstanding out there that we believe have either uh, fled the state or even fled the country because they know they're wanted. Uh, you know, that process is still uh, going on. Uh, it's sometimes difficult to locate people and, and dedicate resources to somebody who has fled the state. But certainly, if we find out that they're in a certain location, we're going to alert those local authorities because just th that doesn't mean they're just by leaving our county or our state, they're going to stop engaging in their activities, right? Whatever community they're in, they're still a threat. So we want them behind bars and we'll get them back to our county however we can. Police also believe that there could be more victims and anyone with information is asked to contact the San Jose Police Department Sexual Assault Investigations Unit. All right, back live now. Some of these crimes date back to 2016, and police said today the reason there was a delay in making an arrest is that the officers who handle this sort of cases, they have a very heavy workload, and also in some uh, cases, the victims didn't immediately come forward to report their alleged attackers. Police needed to then investigate, and fortunately, there's no statute of limitations when it comes to sex crime, so police were able to move these cases forward. But for now, in the South Bay, Charles Clifford, Cronfor News.